we've had floods around our area, so hopefully where we're going is not too bad, even though it's right near the canal. Start of our new journey, 2024. <laughs> what we've got planned for today is we're here with Catherine and Steve from Fieldview Adventures, and we're going to head off into Devizes. Mm. So there's the castle walls, the old castle walls. But it's quite a popular pub, obviously, because of the history with it and uh, the hauntings that happen there that still happen today, apparently. Loads of history in this place. It is, it is worth a visit, definitely. Good morning, and we're off again on our winter travels. This is the reality. We're now in the storage yard, just sorting out, um, waiting to leave, really. So we've packed everything up and we're now having brunch, I suppose. Yeah, and we're trying out these new mics, so I'm careful. I'm eating my... Uh brunch as you call it <laughs> and I don't want to be chomping down the mic so I have to be more careful of what I'm doing with this on so remembering that it can pick it up <laughs> yeah so even if the camera's over here then uh, we should pick up each other on on the mic so we're just chomping. seeing how it goes and um yeah so we're gonna go to a nice site today and um I'm sure um, we're going to let everyone know what we're doing for this year. Yes, we're going to be doing a vlog while we're there for our future plans, which are very exciting, I can't wait. And we're meeting up with some friends. We are. And there'll be a separate vlog of what we're doing with them. That's right. So, uh, right, let's get to it. We've had floods around our area, so hopefully where we're going is not too bad, even though it's right near the canal. Right, padlock unlocked. One gate. Oh, <laughs> that's one. That down, make sure it doesn't move. Massive puddle here. So you've got to guess where it goes. Hold this up and let Lee out. Job's a good one. Hello, my dear. Hello. <laughs> all right. <laughs> yeah. We're all done then. Gates are locked. Yeah, but there's a puddle and you can't see where you put in the the, yeah. the um, doofer in the hole. Oh, no. So, she can't see where she's putting the doofer in the hole. Yeah, so I had to sort of line the gates up and guess, but uh, it's locked, so that's the main thing. Start of our new journey, 2024. <laughs> Shall we go? Yeah. We're going back to Devizes. Yeah. Um, to vlog Devizes, because we, we had... So much fun at the locks last time. We didn't get enough time to film Devizes itself. No. We're no. going to look around some of the historic buildings, aren't we? But we'll tell you more about that when we get there. When we get there, because yeah. um, there's a lot of historic buildings in Devizes, and we're going to go and try and explore as many as we can, but we'll tell you that. Once we get set up. Once we get set up. And we're meeting some friends. We are. So we're just travelling to Devizes and one of the roads was shut, but we've had a lot of rain here and it actually had the police closed on it. I've got a feeling it was something to do with it, an accident or flooding, or maybe something's got stuck in a flood. <laughs> um, as we were approaching, we had people saying us to turn around. Um, so we had to find a little bit of road with a tiny lay-by in to do like a 10-point turn. <laughs> no, it wasn't that bad, but... Well, it was a 10-point turn, but I've done it in four. Just one glass in, you're already on my mind When it gets late, I always realize that I need you Are you thinking about me too tonight? It's no secret, all my friends already know There's no reason to hold it back, I let it show All my feelings, are you thinking about me too tonight? Well, that was a bit of a drive. We're just arriving, um, pulling into the lane right next to the three magpies. Mm -hmm. But it was a bit of a drive, wasn't it, Leigh? It was, yes, but we got here in one piece. Sweeter than summer wine, baby, just hold me tight. Like a drug, I am hooked on you. So we've just pulled up, set up, and 
We've got the heating on because it's still pretty cold, isn't it? It is. It is cold, on. so it ain't too bad because the sun's been shining. So after that wet weather we had yesterday, sun's shining, so it's all good. So this is the view from the window. So that that field there, you can park on there when the grass is dry, um, or you can put tents on there, whatever. Um, but we're in the car park, and Lou's going to show you around the car park a little yeah, bit. Yeah. So I'll quickly take you round. Um, so it's the three magpies in devices. Well, Melksham, isn't it? Melksham, so just outside. It's devices. just outside devices, but it's right next to the canal. And the um, camping and caravan club, club site is near it. Yeah, camping and caravan and club site. So it's it's about twenty five pounds and sixty pence a night, I think, to stay here. But I'll take you out and we'll have a quick a quick look at where the van's sitting. This is where our pitch is, anyway. I'll show you the field in a minute, but it goes all the way back here. So I suppose it's just like any of these sites then. They've got electric hookup and stuff like that. Sitting in there nicely, little entrance. It's all behind the pub as well. So let's, uh, let's take you and show you the field. We are here with friends this weekend. But it looks like you can go all the way around to the back here. So they've got a couple more hard standing pitches just, just over there. In the summer, I can see it being quite nice. It goes right back there, so there's plenty of electric hookups along the side. And as Jody said, right next door, just, just over that way, is um, the camping and caravanning club site. You know, but you, you pay for a lot more for that, so it just depends what you want. But this is a good sort of stopgap, it has got toilet facilities. So it's next morning, we had a good night's sleep here, didn't we? Beautiful sleep actually, weren't too bad. A little bit of road noise, but nothing massive. No, I didn't notice. I was well gone. <laughs> we had um, a few drinks with some friends, didn't we? Yeah, so... Um, nothing mad. Um, and I cooked a chilli at home yeah. and uh, brought some with me and shared a bit of that. It was lovely, yeah. <laughs> chilli and jacket potatoes. Nice warming meal. What we've got planned for today is we're here with Catherine and Steve from Fieldview Adventures and we're going to head off into devices mm. now we've been down to the canal and last time we were here you can walk into devices <clears> bump <throat> through the canal um mm. but it is absolutely bogging because of the rain yeah and there's been floods all around this area yeah and they want to take boo as well and boo's got the buggy so it would be a little bit too much so um we could get a cab but we've decided we found a bus yeah route, so we? bus stop just mm. outside the the pub there so yeah. we're going to take that down to devices we're just having a walk up from where the van's parked on the campsite up to the pub, uh, three magpies, because the showers aren't working properly, the power keeps cutting out, doesn't it? Yeah, so I've done the trip switch on it, but um, obviously it's advertised with showers and if you've got no light in there at night, it's not that great. I think pump. the hot water still works, but no, it's cold. No, she said, it, she said um, the hot water works, but it's cold. It's cold in the shower. <laughs> Confuse me. You know what I mean? The hot water, <laughs> the water's warm. But the, the inside the shower block's cold. Yeah, so we're going to go and see. I know. Men what I was mention thinking. it and see what they can do. There's the old posing outside. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the three magpies. The sun is right in my eyes. I'm not complaining, like, because. Uh, <laughs> January and the sun's shining. But that's where um, the campsite is, just down there. Just take you round so you come through here. Run past these bins. Um, and this is the way that we went in a minute ago. We were seeing that Lee went in. Yeah, so. Just campsite entrance. It's just down here. Right, let's go find this bus stop. Somewhere. Just over there. Over that way? Yeah. Oh, I can see it. This is the bus stop just over the road from the Free Magpies. And it takes you into Bath via Devizes. So it's straight across the road from either that campsite or camping and caravanning as well, which is just down there. Quite handy. And we're here. Just left Steve and Catherine over there somewhere. Yeah. Uh, I think they've gone to Greg's. I think, yeah, they're going for a bit of food. <laughs> we not had a chance to get anything to eat yet. Um, but we're going to head off to the museum and catch up with them guys later. So the first building we've found is the actual Wiltshire Museum. And as it says there, look, gold from the time of Stonehenge. 
Right, well we just entered the museum, the Museum. Um, apparently it's got 500,000 years dating back, way back, of history um, for Stonehenge. Um, yeah. And the items in here was worn by people that worship within the circle. Worship the circle. Yeah. So we're we're going to have a little look, we're and we're we're uh, well. have a little look at the prices. So let's check that out. So we just found out it's eight pound per adult. The concession charge is seven pounds. It's seven pounds. And under eighteens are free. Completely by the door. Well, that's a nice uh, memorial, isn't it? So yeah, the so men. Devices. Um, who fell in the war, 1914 to 1919. Yeah. So really good plaque. And that's just outside St John's um, Church, which we're going to go and have a look at now. Yeah, it looks beautiful the church as well. Yeah. This is really nice and nice and clear, it's just stop them in. Yes. We found the next place. St John's Church. This was dating back to the 12th century, um, placed here I think by the Bishops of Salisbury and it was the church for the castle which we haven't seen yet. Yeah we're going to try and mm. find that. Yeah so apparently there is a castle in Devizes, not sure if we can get in there yet neither. So is this a building we can access? What have we got here? Come in. Come in, yeah. It looks like you can access it. What does it say on the door? Please close the, the door, door after door. entering and when leaving the church. Well, they've got any services on, so... Yeah. Let's open the door and find out, shall we? What's up there? <laughs> it will be scary. Open, it's got yeah. CCTV, it? Oh well, don't think it's open. <laughs> no. It does say it doesn't have anything on today, like service wise or anything like that. So it's probably why. Yeah. Um, anyway, there's a bit of history over the other side of the church, so let's go and find out what that is. They look Tower Lee. He gets everywhere, does Lee? Yeah. We we'll head down here. I think, if I'm right, I think you can see the side of the castle from down here. I think people still live here, but another plaque, so the Saxons, the Sextons, is that how you say it? Yeah. Sextons Cottage, Cottage. 1615. Let's look down here. So there's the castle walls, the old castle walls, and I think Devizes was actually a place that was, you know, you lived within the castle walls back in the day. And you can just see the church up the top there, and this is the old grounds, I'm sorry, the castle, and this is the old grounds for that. I'll see if we can uh, zoom you in. Yeah. This looks like um, an old iron bridge, doesn't it? Where does this take you to? Well, looks like you can go in some kind of gardens, look. Just around the back of the castle. It's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Did we see something about... something negative about this place? I believe it was Michael Ryan and he was part of the Hungerford Massacre. Yeah. Um, and this is where he used to train firing down with his there shotgun. Somewhere, yeah, unfortunately. Unfortunately, which is, you know, not the greatest if you want to, to know what that, If you want to know what that is, you'll have to Google it. It's yeah. not a really positive thing to be talking about no, on here. But no. yeah, this apparently this is where he used to practice. Mm. So unfortunately it's got some... Just down here in the grounds, yeah. Yeah, negativity about this area. Mm. But it's a lovely place now. I can see squirrels and stuff. Lovely. All running around in the gardens enjoying themselves. I believe we can get up to the entrance of the castle, which we will try and do. I believe the castle's private owned now, isn't it? So yeah. owned by like so. 
the council or whatever. It's actually it's actually owned by pri private owners and um, they don't really like you going up there. No, <laughs> which you can understand because yeah. it's like someone walking onto your, your path <laughs> driveway to your house. But we'll see how close we can get if we can get a bit closer to the other side, won't we? Yeah, St John's Church now we've seen that, seeing the side of the castle. And this is apparently one of the oldest streets in Devizes, um, just down here. Um, it's called St John's Court. And there's a medieval hall right there. Number four on the list. It's at number four on the door as well. Oh, number four on the door. But yeah, St George's Court. So. I think this is near where the old town hall is. I'm not sure if it's the building in yeah, front. It's, it's and there got, it is. They've got plaques on a lot of the old stuff, haven't they? Yeah, it's so you understand. But this is the old town, well, the old town lockup. What's that about? Is that like an old prison? Maybe. Could be, couldn't it? Here, didn't they? Huh? They used to have the courts in this area, so that would oh, be one right, of those. Yeah. 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 Because there's lots of um, underground. Right. Uh, like, what do we call them? Dungeons? Dun <laughs> so, and I believe that they led to the courts. Right, right yeah. Yeah, so. Oh, but if you know more than us, sellers. shove it in the comments. Yeah, just tell us. So let's go and have a look. I said sellers. <laughs> let's go. Like sellers. sellers. <laughs> yeah, just you can us. sell us as well. <laughs> no. Tell us and sell us. <laughs> sellers, as in sellers <laughs> underground. Yeah, this is the town hall. So it was a bit of a lock up at the back. It's quite a big structure. As you can see, we won't be getting into the castle. No. Authorised access only, but it's just up there. That was the original entrance, I believe, to the castle. Um, but you can't have access nowadays, unfortunately. Um, there is vlogs out there where people have gone up, but we're not going up. Not this time. Not this time. It looks like there's a trowel, medieval trowel down here. Yeah. Crown Centre. Yeah. Former coaching in. 1538. The Pepper Mill Hotel. There's lots of uh, Lots of history in Dubai. There's lots of pubs and restaurants that've got history behind them, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, there is. Yeah. And there's lots of shops as well. We might take you around some of the shopping in a minute as well. I'm gonna go and find you the old town hall. Yes, I can't find it. With, with, um, I think it's that's the old town hall down there. But so where's the new town hall? This is it, isn't it? No, it's a gallery. Look at all them buildings. Even that bare hotel there looks quite old. And uh, well, how yeah, old that is? Yeah, I mean, we could spend all day going round. They say there is a trail. That building over there, it says Corn Exchange on it. It's like the. Funny one, isn't it? Yeah. What's that sound on there? I don't know, there's a Oops. pigeon up there. <laughs> What's that say? Crofts. Huh? It says the Market Crofts. Crofts. Yeah. Ah. Was erected by Henry Viscount Sidmount. Can't read that. No, <laughs> it's all like, it yeah. but it's from 1814. <laughs> it's um, it is just a little bit hard it's, to it's read. It's quite prominent, actually, in the middle of the town. Yeah. Or market town. You know, and we're going to go. Should we go and check out? We've seen something. The shambles. They call yeah, it. Yeah, we're going to go see what that's about. And this is called the shambles, arts and crafts. Clothes, pet supplies, home decor, vintage. Look in here then. It's quite nice, isn't it? It's an early butcher's market. <laughs> 1835. There is only one of you, only one of me. There's a million of those who won't let us be. But they're not gonna, not gonna see me bleed. It goes right through to the other side. You, you, you. You've got like all antique stuff and that. Yeah, it seems to be, doesn't it? I've been scared to live because some people never learn. But they're not gonna, not gonna watch me burn. Because, baby, I got you, 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 you. It's a new beginning to a better life. It's a dancing underneath the disco lights. They can try, but they can never take me down. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
You've had it. He always magpies. salutes magpies. He's going to be. <laughs> he wouldn't let me get that. <laughs> It was just for like different styles, arts and crafts, sweets. Yeah. It's all about, like old fashioned kind of stuff. Mm. Right? It, was, it was, yeah, it was just. It's quite nice, really. Like old yeah. gear, wasn't it? Yeah. Very nice, the shops. Yeah. We would have thought inside market, but it's an old butcher's market. Um, yeah. Goes back to 1835, I think. Nice. So the sign said, anyway. Loads of history in this place. It is it's worth a visit, definitely. There is another church up there, look. Huh? That's a different one to the one we were looking at. Yeah, isn't it? it's a different church. Not sure what that one's called. Yeah. It's a wheelchair air emblem shop over there. Alright. Bye. It's like the main strip. Main precinct down there. Yeah. So you see that sign up there? Wadworth. Wadworth is the main brewery around here. Yeah. It? And they have a visitors. Yeah, they have a visitor centre, which we're probably going to go up and have a quick look at. We will do, yeah, yeah. definitely. You've got Lee's Jewellers over there. He gets everywhere. He does. <laughs> You've got Reeve the Baker there. Yeah, look that the bread place. looks gorgeous, doesn't it? What do they call that? That's a loaf, sourdough. So they look really nice, don't they? Mm. Some nice food in there. It's making me hungry and the smell coming out of it. Is it making you hungry? I'm starving, yeah. So we're going to get a Greg's. Yeah. We went to other bakers, smelt that lovely food, then decided to go to Greg's. <laughs> mm. Oh, this is messy. Maybe not a good circuit. idea. Is it nice and hot as well? It's all right. Oh, yeah. right, okay. It's warm. Like warm. Mm. That's all right. So it's a... I'll leave him to eat his Greg's in peace. Yeah, this is a bear hotel as you get a bit closer. Is that actually meant to be a bear on the top there, is it? Or is that like a... Yeah, oh, I think that's looks a more like a panther, doesn't it? It's eating a raspberry <laughs> or something. Some grapes. Yeah. We just met back up with uh, Steve, Catherine, Zach and Boo again. And we're just going to be find somewhere yeah. to sit down and grab some food. I'm starving. I think we're going to look at the black swan. Yeah. Which we've um, been yeah. reading, isn't it? It's got a lot of history. We've, yeah. There's been um, a program that's been gone on in there about the haunted um, rooms and the cellars downstairs, and apparently it's one of the most haunted buildings yeah. um, in Devizes. Yeah. So they say. So we'll go in there and see if we can ask them a bit of history, see if they know anything. Yeah. They yeah. might do, might they? Mm. That's probably the place oh, to be at one time a day. Yeah, probably. Is that a theatre or is it? Um, I reckon, it was. I reckon it was something like that anyway. The palace. I see a kebab. <laughs> see a kebab up here. <laughs> Brilliant. Stickers and burgers. Stephen kebabs. Trust Steve to find that. <laughs> this is a lot of these old carvings in the walls. I don't know what the meaning of that one is. Oh, hang on. Yeah, there we go. Look. There was a surgeon that lived there in 1825. So, that was an old surgery, right. I believe. And this is the Black Swan. And I'm not sure. Let's see if we can take dogs in. See if we can take dogs in because um, we have Boo with us. Yeah. I believe you can take dogs. The beer garden, I think it goes all the way around the back there. But unfortunately today we can't get in because all the tables are full, um, which is a shame. But it's quite a popular pub obviously because of the history with it and uh, the hauntings that happened there that still happen today apparently. Um, yeah. So we'll find somewhere else, see if we can get warm. Snuff Street. That's a strange name for a street. It does, yeah. So they're open. The lamb in. We're gonna try that one. See if we can get in. 
I think we're the only ones in. Yeah. <coughs> what do you think is that place then? That's right, it's quite quirky. Um, wonky floors, wonky yeah. furniture, old yeah. furniture. There was one part where Boo moved in his uh, buggy and the buggy started going down the hill in the <laughs> <laughs> yeah, It's that wonky floor, but yeah. it was really, um, yeah, it was nice because, you know, it's old and yeah. Yeah, it just felt like it was in a proper British pub, you know? Yeah, you, you know there was history there. Um, and they'd probably have live music, they've got a Facebook page as well. Um, so the lambing and devices, if you're interested in what they're up to, check the Facebook page out. Mm, yeah. So, very welcoming anyway, the lady so, was lovely. Yeah, so where are we off to now? I'm going to have a look at the brewery. So that's where we're heading. A new Park Street. So we're going to go and check out the visitors centre of the brewery. It's just through here. I believe they used to do tours and stuff like that, but that's all gone now. Yeah. <laughs> They've even got uh, a little bar up there. And then you can buy all the merchant's ice from the uh, visitor centre. <laughs> oh, what's that? What was old timer? Old timer, eh? Oh, that's yeah. definitely for you. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, if you want to buy all your merchandise and that, then you can check this place out. I showed you a little bit in there. We can't show you everything because um, filming's a bit difficult with the noise and everything. But they don't do tours. Um, you can buy a lot of the merchandise. So, well worth a look anyway. I think we're going to go and head back and get a bus now. Is that what we're doing? Getting the bus. Back to site. That's us saying goodbye to Fieldview Adventures. We're off up north to visit family. Safe travel, guys. Bye. Till next time. <laughs>
yeah, we're going to actually shoot that straight after we've yeah, finished this one. We are. Um, so I look forward to that for next week. Um, and you can sort of follow us on our journey. So keep tuned with us uh, and see what we're up to. Yeah. So thank you again to everyone that subscribed. All the new subscribers as well. And um, yeah, we'll see you on the next one. Till then, bye. See ya.